something I would like you to confirm because I don't want to put words in your mouth. You when you refresh my memory, what really happened? Mm, I said, I said, I just got, but um, I think uh, we are coming late. But let me go straight to what you asked me. I went on a personal uh, Church and I started from the school farm. Yeah, my brother, who was the, was then the vice principal before they were dissolved. So I took some pictures then, and uh, I began to ask him some questions. He said uh, he believed the handlers has compromised and they are. Uh, uh working with the land grabber. I asked him why he thinks like that or why he's uh thinking the people handling the project are working with the land grabbers. He said there was a situation that came up one day because he's a son of the soil, so he lived there and uh some of the land grabbers came close to where he was staying and we are measuring and and uh, uh i think they wanted to sell a piece of land to somebody there close to his place so he was trying to confront them and they called uh they called the uh, tumor and uh, when they came he explained to them why he called them and the people were there when they came and they stepped aside with the people and after some discussion they told him to let them continue and they left so that's in that action we believe that they are working hard in blue mm -hmm. so from what you told me you went back to Lagos from Ibek, and then what happened? Yes. And then what happened? I went back to Lagos, and I attended the Lagos branch meeting. That year, I think uh, the meeting was held at uh, at a, not CNC, but one of us that was living in Maryland, the Kedja. And I raised up the issue, the pictures I I, I took, the videos, and uh, I made every effort to convince them. But I understood that uh, the people like uh, CNC worker, people like uh, the former minister, uh, 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 what's his name? Former, who's his name? Yeah, Enelama. 
They have given too much, so much support that they don't even want to hear anything wrong about uh, about Shuma. Uh, even when I was trying to me, I said, let's hear this young man. He had, we have a point. They say, no, they don't want to hear. And uh, I have no other option than to, to keep quiet. Hmm. When, 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 when was this? Was this in 2020 or 2019? That should be 20, under 2021. That should be either 2020 or 2021 in this new year. Mm. I even, I even invited the the so-called land grabbers uh, chairman because what why i call him chairman is uh, he is from where we call uh Oman and, mm. and uh, the uh, majority of the land is owned by them and he is the uh the, the uh, land property chairman in the village so I called him and told him the implication of what he's doing. He came up with some uh, arguments, which I told him was not valid. He said that uh, they had a, a, a letter from uh, Robert, uh, Reverend Robert Fisher that they will be training their children since 1929. They never trained anybody. I told him I was born and brought up in the school. I have a, a, an in-depth knowledge of uh, what goes there, at least from 1970. I told him that uh, the man they called Mwakama, I was trained by the school. And moreover, then, the misunderstanding then was that that school was called Government College Umudike and not to my hair. And that it was in 1972 that the big people or the many people now concluded the, the, the court case that gave them the ownership of that land. But the Reverend Robert Fisher did not write to Umwana people. He wrote to Mujike people. Even in his letter, he mentioned the Umujike chief. So that is the misconception. And moreover, that the school has gone out of uh, uh, private uh, uh, handling to, uh, uh, to state government handling. So those things we are not valid and does not give them enough room to uh, intervene in the property of the school. Then you mentioned it um, on your class platform, right? Yes, I did. I, I personally met with my class captain, the then class captain, Bill to I, uh, and told him, gave him the, the pictures. I told him that the the land grabber chairman told me categorically that actually it was the action of uh Chuma that gave them the livery to begin to uh grab the land i said what is that one he said Chuma came and the marketed from immediately uh, after the the principal's house and put a fence making them believe that they have taken their own. So that's why they begin to drop. Hmm. Anyway, uh, the reason MGC come you told me this, I believe it's been a year now. More than a year. More than a year. And um, I was hoping we would not need your testimony, eh? But it's gotten to a point that I confided in Obi Wakama. Do you know him? 
Yes, uh, I know you come. Yes, yeah, so you... No, 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 no. Only you come from where I thought you are talking from Wakudo. No, no, no. Wakudo and Wakudo. Yes, we see how the junior Wakudo, the one is in the... Obi, Obi, the name of that one is Oh, is it from your village? Yeah, I'm from uh, Omar Fire, the next village to Omar Oh, sorry. Makodo was my classmate. Very okay. nice, very nice man. Very okay. nice. Um, Obi Wakama is, okay? is a journalist. Eh? Okay. Um, so when I told him this, because everyone is doubting that I catch you, Mamudi, went on at this matter. Eh? Yeah. So he said they would like to interview you. Kono from the horses mat. I'm see you okay. I will first of all get your permission. And then it's two thirty AM here. Maybe much later tomorrow, eh? Yeah, I'm really sir. Much later. We can call you three or four so that Kojirinti and no. In my name, Kudistin, nobody wants to believe it. You what, Allah? We are still saying it today. Okay, look at uh, what place. You know, the Lagos uh, branch had their uh, election last two Sundays. TNC, uh, came down and uh, the people were coming for the positions and um, we made it clear to them that uh, Chuma has stabbed for for over 13 years. He has no need to be there again. Let him allow fresh hands to go. He wanted to go for the chairman who there was a clamp down and he went on that ground. On the last day of the election, he came up to handle the secretary uh, uh, department. And they have already decided for that. And uh, before we know it, they gave it to him. So he still wants to be connected so that every information that is coming, he can still be tapping it and uh, sending to the people that are supporting him. Who do a lot are, go ahead, sir. Go ahead. A, a lot are into this. You know, I I I must tell you the truth. Chuma is involved. I that same day, as I was standing in front of uh, the principal's house, I saw a boy that did the gate of my house and he stopped. He said, ah, day. How are you? I said, fine. Say, you came. I said, yes. Came to check my all my mother. I said, ah, he drew me by the side. He said, ah, Chuma has finished your property. I said, how? Oh. He said, a lot, a lot, a lot. He said, even, okay, take for example, he said, there was no need for Chuma because he's a builder too. Thank you for the information. So, but the issue is that some people like uh, CNC worker, uh, worker and uh, and uh, the then uh, minister, they don't want anything said against Chuma and some of their likes. So, but, they are on top and uh, there's the, nothing we can do. Who, what do, are you referring to Nelama? Nelama, yes. Okay. They were the people that handled, handed over the whole thing to Shuma. Shuma was not doing anything in Lagos. Hmm. Shuma hmm. takes direct flights for every, every, every time it's coming. I don't know how to put it, but it, it is an issue that uh, because of uh, they, they believe they don't want uh, uh, much rank or they don't want anybody to come and say their own part. Which I'm ready at any time. I still have the guy. 
the guy that was then the uh, vice principal, he gave me a life uh, confession. You can see come up to testify to those things. Oh, the, I really, in fact, when I told Obi Wakama that you were willing to testify and that you were doing it freely without anybody bribing you or coercing you, he, he was pleasantly surprised. So he's eager to talk to you. Eh? So, I'll be willing to, to talk to him too. No problem, Biko. Um, I would, we will call you much later tomorrow, Nola. Eh? Okay, sir. Thank you very much. God bless you, sir. And you too.